Hello my beautiful people, hello my beautiful Sagittarians, this is your weekly love tarot reading, thank you so very much for stopping by on my YouTube channel even a tarot. So, weekly love reading May 23rd until 29th 2022. Sit back, relax and have some fun with me, Sagis, this is your first message. Release. Release honey, release old energies, old people, old wounds, old problems, old even wishes and hopes because in front of you is something completely new. It's obvious you are ending one big chapter of your life and you are entering into a completely new cycle. What is really going on? We will see throughout the reading. But this couple of days ago, solar eclipse in a sign of Scorpio obviously means something real big for you. What exactly? I don't know. Since this is a weekly love tarot reading, Sages, it looks like on your love menu should be releasing, you know. So make a wish because you are entering into completely new cycle of your life okay now let me see what this person of yours or person on your mind what exactly this person want to say to you i have such a beautiful deck so concrete and now we will see what exactly they want to say or how they feel about you. Okay, let me shuffle for a couple of more seconds. So let me see. Please, please answer my call. There you go. Sages, um, this is your ex. Please answer my call. You want to release someone. You want to forget about someone. You want to walk away from someone but it, it looks like this person can't let go of you calling you again again and again pleading you please answer my call it looks like you are watching on the other side dealing with someone new or maybe you need some solitude or guys you know whatever so this could be possible reconciliation for some of you if you want to do such a thing if not if you think it's over if you consider no going back then this is for sure end of cycle so it could be departure for some of you and could be cleansing your heart and cleansing your mind your life is transforming and you are entering uh, into phase of rebirth in time I love you even more. Sages, what can I say? Have mercy on this person because it looks like this person is destroyed. So you walked out from this person and this person is still calling you, having a lot of obviously emotions for you. Wow, Sages, of course this is completely up to you. But my job is simply to translate, you know, cards which I draw for you. Now, let's find out together what will happen next and let's find all the juicy details. Two of Cups. Careful, Sages. Careful, careful. Please be very, very careful. And let me tell you another thing, you are the only one zodiac sign for this week having two of cups, unconditional love. This is glorious week for those of you who are searching love. This is beautiful week for all of you who are still in love with your ex. Maybe you are deeply hurt, Pro probably you are. Probably you're seeking more time, you're seeking more space for yourself. But guys, you have unconditional, uh, uh, unconditional love card. So let me remind you once again, in time, 
I love you even more and more. So who is this person loving you so much? Who is this person crying so hard over you? Who is this person who can't let go of you? Honey, you know who they are. You know who they are. For those of you who are happily attached, be careful what you are saying because it looks like you really need more space for yourself. Uh, you can hurt your partner. This also could be a current partner saying to you, please, you know, answer my call. So what is going on inside of you, Sages? You know, what is going on inside of you? Are you ready to continue your love relationship with your current partner or not? What this person is in stress because of you? Queen or King of Cups, because I need to mention both genders. Uh, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio is very, very emphasized in your reading. So let me see. Something happened or something might happen between the two of you. So let me see. This person was too honest with you and it looks like this is your long face or something, you know. So it looks like you want to punish your partner because this person said something, you know, to you. Uh, you shouldn't do that. You know, this person is honest and very giving and very emotional towards you. This person is emotional to the highest degree. Honest with you to the highest degree. Okay? Very loving and very caring. If you are searching for love, careful guys, you are entering into something completely new. It looks like many of you, you simply want to leave behind your back a big chunk of your life. Maybe there is something that you want to forgive to yourself. Maybe you made a couple of mistakes and now this is you saying, okay, I am gonna make my mistakes again, ever again. From this week on, I'm turning new page in the book of my life. Ooh, beautiful. Beautiful. This is kind of fertility. Excellent for love, for marriage, for pregnancy. We, uh, we can see a woman holding a little baby. We can see a harvest time, fruits, vegetables, which is a sign of harvesting time. Your creativity will finally pay off. Uh, it looks like you have a real good friend. I think a woman who is so good to you. Your mother is so good to you. Helping you all the way. When it comes to love, Libra could be very important. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio and Taurus. So there is a magical connection between you and this person. Some of you will be pregnant if you are female Sagittarians and this pregnancy could accelerate relationship between the two of you. Seven of Pentacles. Well, Seven of Pentacles usually talk about um, job and money and business and working so hard, trying to prove something, trying to give. This is also kind of delayed success delayed money or something also it's a card when you need to stand still before you make up your mind what exactly you want to clean what exactly you want to release so success and love is coming towards you in a very slow way so like slowly but surely success of any kind is coming your way and um, sometimes you give so much and when you have a problem, a conflict with anybody, but especially with your love partner, you simply don't understand why some people are punishing you because you tend to give so much. If you are lonely and single, I know that this loneliness is killing you. But honey, you ain't going to stay single. You have two of cups, 
person who is calling you repeatedly and person who is saying to you in time, I love you even more and more. Pay attention. This could be soulmate, maybe even twin flame connection with a person who maybe do not know how to show openly feelings for you, Emperor. Thank you, Lord. So when I see Major Kana, the Emperor, I know everything will be much more better than even you can imagine in your wildest dream. How come? Because this is alpha male. This is your future husband. This is trustworthy person. This is lawful, serious, matured partner in your life. This person will reach out to you because this person needs you, likes you and loves you seriously. Both of you are very strong personalities. Both of you are very independent. But this time you need to show your truthful colors because this is exactly the same what this person will do with you. So hold on your breath. Because so many things on so many levels will happen to you. If you feel this very second emptiness inside of you, this is exactly uh, how you should feel. Because a lot of new things and events are coming in a very big speed towards you. Comment, like, share, subscribe and schedule private reading if you want Okay, big week, big week, very, very big week, Sages for you. So consider, will you answer this big phone call? God bless, bye.